replying to all my stuff. And Look at this guy. I got doing? video now. <laughs> Gotta finish cooking as it cools. Cooling is, is a part of the cooking process as well. Mm. So you never want to overcook anything. Seafood usually comes out more saltier than people anticipate because of the level of salt that is held inside of the seafood from the water. Okay. And where that the makes creature sense. lives in. That makes sense. And seafood seasoning generally has a lot of sodium. Oh, okay. So you only need a little bit. I'm gonna flip these shrimp. Look at that. Look at that shrimp. Very smoky. Very smoky. The alarms are sounding. <laughs> but everyone's fine. We're all safe. Safe and sound and about to pick out on some serpent turf. The flavor is in the char. Get a little smoky, okay? Okay, here we go. Skewer. Skewer so that while it's cooking, the meat can stay straight. Oh, okay, you're keeping it straight. Got you. Otherwise, it'll shrivel up and make like this weird shape. Smart. Wicked smart. Um, Putting it in the oven at 425. I'll leave those suckers in there. Got the boiled potatoes, we mashed them down, and they need what? Plenty of salt. A ton of salt. And I am black, and I love black pepper. Jukari is black, and he loves black pepper. That makes sense. Okay. <laughs> there it is. Heavy whipping cream. Und now we whip. Oh, he's got butter. We're gonna use, we're gonna use four sticks of butter today. And it's gonna be gorgeous. We're gonna fucking chow down. Oh me, oh baby. That's gonna be for the broccoli. We're gonna get some cheddar broccoli going. It's gonna be good. And our lobsters out. Look at these puppies. Just a little pink on top. So yeah, I mean just just barely touched really. Oh yeah. Beautiful. So that when you squeeze it, it's nice and mild. Roll the citrus first. I like lime better than lemon. Oh, me too. That's why for the most part, I always have limes on here and not lemon. With my seafood, I eat lime. Just searing with a little oil. Why are we searing it? Why don't we just... Searing, honestly, is just for a dramatic presentation. Nice. Love me some drama. And it makes it hot, the temperature. Mm -hmm. It makes it hot so the juices are more flowable. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's just for dramatic. Honestly, really, the main reason is just dramatic irritation. I love it. I'm not going to lie to you. Don't lie. That's what you want. Beautiful. So the caramelized. The caramelization was the tip for when it's done. Okay. What was it like five minutes? It was a minute. There's the potatoes with the parsley. We're going to that again. We got some plating going on here. Coming together. One and a half tablespoons of butter and a shit ton of minced garlic. About two tablespoons. You want to roast it first to get a little brown. Okay. Just gonna make it kind of sweet. Perfect. Turn the temperature down. I'm working with dairy. Dairy burns fast. Dairy what? Burns fast. Dairy burns fast. Medium heat. Some caramelized garlic. And here comes the whipping cream. Beautiful. Gorgeous. 
Green and white. Green and white. Here we go with the parsley. Presentation, y'all. A little bit of salt. And. And last but not least. There you are. The traveling chef. Well, because you're black, right? Black pepper? Absolutely. There it is. Because black people don't cook without it. And all of a sudden the pepper hit and it just like exploded in right? my nose. Oh my God, yes. Very That's nice. the sauce, baby. We're gonna turn it, yep, yep. He's doing chef shit now. Look at this, look at this motion. Look at this elbow motion. And the vans, look at the vans. Oh, what a guy. Look how beautiful. around so it doesn't burn and now we're just covering it we're just covering everything in fucking cream and garlic now look at that look at that look at it dripping you want some of your potatoes sure why not would you like some cheese sauce on your potatoes i think so yeah i think so Sargento! Sargento! No matter what it is, you always want to use, I like to use, anyway, cream when I'm making any kind of sauce. And and it makes it what? What's the texture? Velvety. 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 It's a velvety sauce. Not gritty, very smooth and creamy. Mmm. I'm just going to put a little bit of our potatoes, because why not? Why not? Oh, we cannot forget. <laughs> I almost forgot the cornbread. <laughs> There's just so much. There's just so. There's just so, so much. So much. Here we go. I got the video. Smile for the camera chef. <laughs> Don't tell me what to do. Here we go. Here we are live at the tree house. Jukari has just made this entire feast in like an hour and a half. It was an incredible journey. Hello. Fuck. This shrimp is so effing good. And we put the little bit of lime on there. So it's got that zing to it. All the garlic in this sauce is just... It's incredible. This shrimp is amazing. She's getting into his steak like now. And I'm done filming because I have to eat this now, so bye. <laughs> looking at the looking at the texture of this beautiful cornbread slice I just grabbed. I'm gonna mop up all my sauce with it. Check that out. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at this beautiful man. Oh my god. This is too much. It's too much. I can't take it. The other night, dear, while I lay sleeping, I dreamed I held you in here in my heart. When I awoke, dear, I was mistaken, and I held my
Please don't say my sunshine away. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs>